Well, back home, unbelievable images in Delaware after an EF2 tornado touchdown in Sussex County. The twister swept through Laurel this morning and ripped homes to shreds. And we have team coverage for you of the Delaware tornado. Meteorologist Kate Bilo will join us in just a few minutes. But first, let's go live to Matt Petrillo. He's on the ground with an up-close look at all the damage. Matt? Yuki, so many roads are still closed here in Laurel, Sussex County. If you take a look behind me, you can see those utility crews are working to restore service right now. Laurel is pretty much in the center of Delaware. It's about two hours south of Philly, 45 minutes inland of Rehoboth Beach. The damage here in Laurel is widespread. This is the worst I've seen it. From above, dozens of homes and barns in Sussex County, Delaware are left in ruins after an F2 tornado ripped through here early this morning. It's going to be a lot of complete losses. A lot. People are going to have to start over. Unfortunately, in Seaford, Delaware, photos show a line of trees knocked over sitting across Route 20. Over in Laurel, this silo is now a mangled mess of metal. Workers here at Tri Oak Farms in disbelief. I have never seen nothing like this around here. I mean, you see it on TV, but you never expect it to happen to you, and you don't know how real it is. And the storm rolled through here around 3 this morning while Kim McWilliams was sleeping. Fast-moving winds ripped part of the roof off from above her bedroom. I got up and was hiding behind a recliner in the living room. <laughs> I, hit the, I hit the floor. What are you going to do? You hear stuff moving, you're going to hit the floor. The storm's strong winds also uprooted this massive tree. It was planted about 70 years ago by this man's mother. She recently passed away. What does that tell you? I don't know. There's something to that, but I don't, I don't know. It's just, it's crazy. And we're told the X's marked on these homes means the people who live inside are safe and accounted for. The National Weather Service is reporting out of all the damage across uh, Sussex County, there is a report of one injury. Reporting live in Delaware, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Matt, thank you.